scratching up. Uh oh. Uh oh. See, yeah, this is why I wouldn't want to. Hi friends, I'm Leslie from PlayDatesParties.com and today I wanted to share with you a recent experiment that I did to see what is the best way to make printable water bottle labels waterproof. A couple weeks ago, my friend Amanda Ray on Facebook asked, what is the best paper to make printable water bottle labels waterproof? Now she said she doesn't want to use regular paper, which I totally understand, but for the sake of finding out the very best option for making water bottle labels waterproof, I figured I'm going to run the gamut and try out as many papers as I can. I tested four different types of paper to see if on their own any of them work well as waterproof water bottle labels. But just to be sure, I also tested three different DIY methods that people have used to make their water bottle labels sealed and waterproof for their parties. In our main experiment, we're going to see how this label, this little cute little water bottle label that I designed, we're going to test it on plain printer paper because if we can get a cheap plain printer paper water bottle label to work, then heck yeah. We are also testing my favorite bright white cardstock, which you can find linked in almost any printables post that I've got. Third, I'm testing glossy photo paper. And finally, I'm testing this weatherproof matte white vinyl sticker paper. Well, now that you know the paper that I tested, what about the three different DIY projects I tested? First up is using a clear acrylic spray on all four different papers to see if that can seal in the ink so that it doesn't run while your water bottles are in the ice bucket. Next, I'm trying clear contact paper because it's rather inexpensive. You can buy a huge roll and you could probably do several parties with one roll. Finally, I'm testing packing tape as an option to cover your water bottle labels as you put them on. Not only should it cover the water bottle labels and make them waterproof, but it should also act as an adhesive to keep the water bottle labels on your bottles. This whole experiment is about finding out which water bottle label works best for your budget and the amount of time you have with the best print quality and the best durability. Let's go ahead and take a look at all those water bottle labels as they sat in, in an ice bucket for nearly two hours.
Okay, so were you surprised? What did you think about these methods to make your water bottle labels waterproof? So I know for me, my personal favorite was using the spray because it's just so much faster. You can do a whole big batch at once as long as your weather is okay and get it done without a whole lot of fuss. Um, but you may prefer the look of the sticker paper. It may be worth it to you to invest the money in the sticker paper so that you feel nice and comfortable and you have something that you can adhere directly to your water bottle without worrying about having to glue anything or other steps such as that. There was a little bit of smudging, but it wasn't a ton. That may be fine for you. It's all what works best for you, for your budget, for your time, and with the durability and quality that you want. So let me know in the comments below what you think, which was your favorite. And if you like this video and want to see more videos like this, to help you do a better job planning your parties and be more informed when you're planning your parties, give me a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button with notifications so you won't miss another video. Thanks so much. Have a great day and have a fun party. I'll see you later.